we understood how we can add images into our editor and how we can create bones. And now let's see how we can mix those together and touch one to another in order to create animation. So for this particular step, I will try to show you how we can um, link the images um, uh, to the bones and why we would do that. I'm going to import one image and I'll import it from, uh, from the import image button and I want to center it a little bit. If I want to, I don't know, zoom out um, a little bit, I can do that as well. Um, so, as I sh I've shown you in, uh, in previous uh, tutorials, I can um, move this image around. Now what I want is to create a bone and try to um, uh, use that bone in order to um, make actions on the image as well. So for this I created the A bone and in order to uh, control the image using the bone I need, I need to link the bone to the image itself. So for this I will go to the button link bone to sprite or just press L key on your keyboard try to match the bone and go right to the picture that you want to attach the bone. So once a picture is detected, it will be automatically selected as you can see right now. Okay, so now the bone is attached to the image and we can see that in the armature um, tree as well. So if I want to um, move the, the picture using the bone, I just want to select the bone and uh, make the actions against the bones and the action is automatically applied to the image as well. If I want to um, move only the image, I will go to select the image and uh, as you can see, we can make um, uh, transformations to the image without um, influencing the bone if I want to block this uh, kind of action, I can go to the tree and try to lock the image. And now I cannot do anything, uh, any action on that image, but using the bone. Okay, um, I think that's about it for this one. Um, please subscribe to our channel in order to receive our next tutorials.